our time. Mm. Yeah, I mean, you're talking about versatility, which brings me perfectly into uh, the next Ross project I want to talk about. So Ross hangs with me. Let me give everyone a little background. We're talking what's going on with this pandemic you have. This is very important with health care. Five million people have lost coverage since COVID hit. And we know statistically that adds to people's risk factors for both getting sick or getting treatment. So as I'm about to turn to another item, which is Rick Ross's new project, it's worth noting he's spoken out about his own health scares. Rick Ross is back at home after four days in a hospital. The medical scare began after someone called 911 and reported that he was unresponsive. This isn't the first time the music mogul has had major medical issues. He suffered two seizures on two separate flights in 2011. I would stay up. 18, 19 hours a day at a time. And after doing this for years, after drinking codeine, Tussinex, and other things, and staying up for years, I actually suffered a seizure from my body not being able to take no more. That's some context. Ross is now partnering with a digital healthcare company that's trying new ways to provide and offer affordable healthcare. And I want to bring in healthcare entrepreneur Tommy Duncan, who's teaming up with Rick Ross and spearheading this new platform. It's called Jet. Doc, uh, this is important stuff here. We love to end the week looking at what people are doing in business. The healthcare business is one out of six jobs. Uh, tell us what you're doing, Tommy. So JetDoc, JetDoc.com, it's like a health plan for $10 a month. You have unlimited access to doctors 24 hours a day, seven days a week, right on your cell phone. And that's for your entire household. You can add four dependents for the same $10 a month. And you can go to pretty much any pharmacy in the country, CVS, Walgreens, Rite Aid, Walmart, and receive up to 85% off the cost of your medication. And let me share with you, Ari. Go ahead. Yeah, let me share with you. So before yeah. we launched JetDoc together, I just sold an insurance company that I built from scratch to Blue Cross Blue Shield. We insured about 50,000 people between Washington, D.C. and Detroit, Michigan. And after selling the company January of this year, I decided as a way to give back, I wanted to provide access to health care to tens of millions of people. And the only way to do that is to make it affordable. And $10 a month is that affordability. A lot of people, as you just mentioned, talk about the 5 million people that have lost their insurance due to the pandemic. But there's also a lot of people that have high deductible health insurance, but they're paying the first seven to $10,000 for the health care coverage. So every time they see a doctor, they're paying out of pocket. For $10 a month, you can avoid paying that and keep some of that money in your pocketbook. Uh, and Tommy, given your background in the industry, uh, one of the reasons I mentioned, beyond the fact that I'm a fan of his music, I mentioned Mr. Ross's entrepreneurship because, you know, people make a lot of mistakes when they, when they have preconceptions or they narrow people. Um, walk us through what it means, the way you're trying to approach this and, and work with Ross and get this out to people as an option in business. 100%. So for me, it's all about affordability creates access. $10 a month, everyone can afford it. We have over 1,000 doctors that are supporting JetDoc already, so people can call in and get access to a doctor. Um, even though we have a system in place that provides great access for affordability, we need to bring eyeballs to it. And there's nobody, as I was thinking about who can I work with to bring attention to health care? And Rick Ross is one person who's different than most who dealt with their private, their healthcare issues privately. He's dealt with his healthcare issues publicly. He's open to talking mm. about it. And because of it, he's the right person to be my partner. Rick, what does this mean to you? Oh man, it's a great opportunity to share my platform um, in one of the greatest ways I can and maybe save lives. One of the things that I experienced the most when I would go visit my doctor is I would be sitting in the waiting room and um, it's a different experience when you sit with people that, you know, when people usually see you, Rose, I'm... No, when you're sitting in, you, it's a life and death situation and you're sitting in, in the waiting room waiting on the doctor and that, that conversation you spark and they tell me they can't afford insurance or whatever it was. I had some of the, the deepest conversations and developed several relationships waiting on the doctor and I felt this was the best way for me to take advantage on my platform. And I thank Tom Duncan for giving me this opportunity. Yeah, and Rick, I got about 40 seconds, but 
In your book, you're very blunt, almost vulnerable about that period with the health scare, even though a lot of your persona is bossing up, being tough. Um, what did that feel like for you to share that just with people with your own health scare? I mean, uh, bossing up and, and being a boss, that's most definitely cool, but life and death is something you can't control. You know, and uh, I was really chasing my dream. I thought I was doing the right thing, staying up 20 hours a day, you know, chasing my dream. It's something I've been working on for 20 years. And uh, I guess my body couldn't take it no more. So once I began suffering seizures shortly after becoming successful, uh, I realized th this wasn't the way to go about this. So we had to make some changes. And this most definitely was the best change I felt we could make. You know, it's uh, the accessibility yeah. is so convenient. I yeah. Hey, I appreciate what you're doing. I gotta go close. to. I, I gotta go to Joy Reid. That's the only reason. I know. Just real Rick quick. Ross. Just real quick. Zedoc.com. You gotta come check this out. We're signing up 100,000 people this week. 25,000 have already goes. signed up. Come With join. the website. The candidates do that too. Tommy Duncan. Appreciate hearing about what you're doing. In your community, Rick Ross. Thank you. That does it for me. Joy Reid starts next. I congratulate you and pledge to you our fullest support in bringing about. An